What's up, gang? Today we are working on a actually three claw machines. Uh, the first one's going to be a ticket time claw, and the problem is, is the the claw's not actually closing when it goes down. This is the same one I had a problem with a couple weeks ago, where the claw wouldn't drop at all. We thought it was a, or I thought it was a motor problem, and so we went and actually took it apart. And once we took it apart, the motor kind of freed up, so it was just kind of jammed somewhere. Um, the other two. Uh, claws that I don't work on. I just need to switch the claws. We have a, a ball claw that has an oversized claw and then we have a plush crane which is the, the do-it-yourself uh, Holland Computers kit. Um, I, I said this probably 10 times in this video but um, so we're just going to switch those two. Put the bigger one on one for a bigger plush and the smaller one for the ball crane. So stick around and I'll show you what we did, how we fixed it, and then we'll do a little bit of gameplay. Okay, I'm working on a ticket to, ticket world crane. Um, I already kind of decased it. Everything's working forward, back, left, and right. Um, the drop works, and I'll show you what happens when I drop it. it does not close. So, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take this off here, and I'm just going to make sure that these wires are attached. And then the next thing I can do is uh, check voltages here, make sure that's good. So I'm going to check that and I'll come right back. So basically I couldn't figure anything out. The voltages were good, wiring looks good. This is the one that was in it. This is a spare that I had. Um, I'm going to go ahead and try this one. Hopefully, I'm thinking maybe the solenoid went bad on this one, which would be odd because it's fairly new. But uh, I'm going to get this one hooked up. We got it all ready to go. So I'm just going to get this wired in and then we'll, we'll see if that was a problem. Hopefully that was all it was. Alright, got this claw strung in here. I've shown how to do this in another video. So the last thing is to just attach these two wires and they go in these two spots up here at the top. And so I'm going to plug those in, wire that up, and then we'll, we'll see if it starts to actually grab. Be right back. Alright, so got it wired in up here you get a credit okay so this is going to be your up switch this is your down switch that part's fine this is where I wired it in at right here so we'll see if it grabs all right got it okay so the problem was was the solenoid inside this guy right here um, so the other one the other claw is fine I just need to get a new solenoid probably comes with this wiring I assume so I'm going to let me get this near me here I'm going to uh, zip tie this up in these spots where it was here and here to make sure this doesn't get pulled out and then I'll put this cover back on and we'll play a couple games see what we win all right before I get to gameplay on that one this is the uh, do-it-yourself uh, crane kit that I put together um, now we put bigger prizes in here, um, so I have the claw off of this one. This is going to be the third time that I put a different claw on here. But we want to be able to win these bigger prizes, so we're going to switch that one with the ball crane while we're doing this. All right, so this is the Neon World. It's the ball crane. This is the claw that was originally on our ball crane, so I know it, it's a good enough size. And this one is a just a little bit bigger, so I'm going to use this one on the... A bigger plush crane so I just need to uh, take it out and it's the same thing it's going to go into uh, these two holes here let me see if I can focus better better there we go so it's going to get plugged into these two uh, oh, keep moving these two right here <clears throat> and that is these two wires right there so it's pretty simple just gotta take this off cut it and make a new knot so we'll go ahead and get that going and then uh, the ball crane should be up and running. Alright, so I got this one wired in. I'm going to go ahead and give it a play and see if uh, the claw works right. 
so it will be hanging down a little bit because I gave myself some more room. And let's go for this pink one right here. Okay, so it does work. So this one is done. I'm gonna put the uh, cage back together. I got it sitting in here. So I'm gonna put that all back together, button it up, and then we're gonna put this claw that's down here in the Route 66 crane. So we'll move on to that one next, and we'll get some gameplay at the end. All right, so this is the final one. Sorry, I'm a little shaky. Got the bigger claw for the uh, bigger prizes here. Okay. See if we can get this ice cream cone here. Right. Okay, so that one's big enough to get the bigger prizes. Go all the way through. Okay, so I'm gonna get this one buttoned up and then we will um, go around and we will play a little bit of each one. Stay tuned. Alright, let's start with the uh, ticket world. Problem with this one was uh, the claw wouldn't close and or grab any tickets. So it would just go down and come back up, no, no closing. Um, and it was the solenoid inside the uh, claw was the actual problem. So let's play a couple of games, see how many tickets we can win. this back in the game and we'll go to the next one okay this is the route 66 crane this is uh, the Holland computers uh, do-it-yourself claw kit that I did um, the problem with this one was the claw itself wasn't big enough to pick up these prizes and we have six cases of these prizes so really needed something that would work so let's just see if we can get this gummy bear over here Nice solid grip. So I'd say that one's good. Let's go check out the ball crane. We moved the claw from this one to the ball crane, the ball crane claw to this one. Let's go check and make sure that one's okay. Okay, this is the Neon World ball claw that we have. Really wasn't any problems with this one. The uh, the claw was a little oversized, so the, the girls have been blowing these balls up a little bit too much, and a couple of them have popped. But other than that, there really wasn't any problem with this, but just gonna make sure that this smaller claw is good. We did check it earlier. We'll play it again for fun. Try to pick up the same one. Alright, that's good. That'll wrap up this video. We'll call that a success on all three claws. Thanks for watching and like and subscribe and pay attention if you need to, uh, if you have any more questions on claw machines. I will do more videos as I come across them. See ya. What did you think about that video? Did you like that video? I loved it. Was I not in it? Well, did I love that? I better have been in that video. I hope you liked the video. It was definitely my best work. If I'm not in that video, you better watch this one over here. Oh, if you're not going to do that, just subscribe. You'll get a notification. Bye.